Hey, how's it going, guy? Hopefully great. How's it going? Hey, how's it going, guys? Hopefully great today. Today is Sunday. Got off work a little bit ago. And we're getting today's video. I'm going to wash the car. And then after I wash it, we'll be applying Jack's Wax Hawaiian Shine right here. First time using it. I bought this um, during that third Thanksgiving sale last year um, for Christmas and stuff. Where they had a uh, mystery box. It was pretty cheap. Or well, a holiday box. It was, sorry, it wasn't a mystery box. And I just haven't tried their, their stuff out yet. Some of their stuff. So basically, this is a Hawaiian Shine detailing spray wax that can be used wet or dry surface. It says too, it removes fingerprints, smudges, and uh, dust from paint, chrome, glass, plastic, wide creating an odd match shine. And basically, um, well, I'll go out the, the, over the directions later. We're gonna, I'll show you what how dirty the vehicle is, and then after I'll wash it, and then we'll apply this right here. Check it out. It is trash. Now, I did go to the spray car wash, and I sprayed it off before. I uh, came home. It did a terrible job too because the stupid nozzle was leaking. I think I got more water on myself than I did on the car. But we'll see how dirty it is and then we'll see what kind of shine we can get from this stuff. Right there. Anybody know that guy? And then kind of get an idea how dirty it is and see what kind of shine we get. I mean, I don't expect for that product to last a long time. You know, maybe give you three weeks to a month. A little bit of protection with that canoe wax maybe over a couple weeks all right we'll get to washing we won't have the whole process of washing it um you know we'll just mainly use the video for the hawaiian shine and for the washing i'm going to be using um some uh the citrus washing gloss from um chemical guys the reason why i'm using that it's kind of got a little bit of a gloss to it not much and the reason why I'm using that, it, it cuts dirt really well. And right now, my the vehicle is pretty much um, any. The last protection I put on the car is the McGuire's Hybrid Spray, and um, and actually we can maybe see if anything's holding up still from it. We can do a little water test after I wash it. But yeah, that's why I'm using that, and we'll try this stuff out. All right, we'll get to washing. I right, grabbed the kit too. Just don't get me this one. How dirty. Flipping around. It's like a, it really needs to be scrubbed off. The sister's wash is getting it though. It's cutting that dirt pretty good. That's why I chose that so it cuts that it's got tar on it with coal on it and it's it's getting it there we go it's a little bit of a difference right, it's dirty all right we got it all washed up so we're gonna apply the hawaiian shine from jack's wax now you can pick this up at amazon i think it was 16.99 but it's cheaper on jack wax website for like 12.99 something like that um i don't know why they have it like that but basically you can uh, put it on dry or wet we're gonna put it on wet um put it on wet well we're gonna put it use it as a drying aid the vehicle's wet you can use it as a drying aid like we're gonna do or you can uh, also apply this dry and then we'll go back to so basically after washing after the vehicle's been washed start the rinse process after fully rinse with water still on the surface you can uh, spray the hawaiian shine on each panel using a microfiber drying cloth to dry the entire vehicle and plus two it says lastly you use a, a flush microfiber to remove any slight wax residue that's left behind after you're done drying and we can check and see and it's supposed to add a nice depth to the paint while adding a little bit of layer of protection that's basically what it says so we'll try it out right here we'll try it on the, the hood we'll do the windows and everything for the video we'll start on the hood as always and then we'll do the rest of the vehicle and we'll show how it looks so let's do some part of it get it primed I don't know what dang that really shot out <laughs> there we go 
spray's nice. We'll basically just work it in here. This paint's not perfect. My daily driver, but after washing it, yeah, the McGuire's hybrid is done. So I think I got a couple months out of industrial environment, which is pretty decent. Check that out, guys. Want to take a look at it? All right. Let's see, I'm going to put this on the windows, too. And it wipes back and forth motion and wipes nice. I would guess, and it takes out water spots. I had a couple little water spots right there. Up here, they're gone. Right here, some right there. Is it gone? Let me spray some. See if it gets rid of those water spots. Yeah, pretty much. Yep, looks like it did. All right, I think it does get a nice little shine to it. All right, let's do the whole vehicle and we'll go back and we'll take a look at it. We'll get some more towels. That's pretty much getting some of those water spots. Can work it in there. Can even reapply it dry to help out. Yeah, looking nice. Dry it a couple times. Time to get some more new towels. Okay, we're all done shining it up with the Jack Wax Hawaiian Shine. What do you guys think? Looks pretty good. Gave it a nice shine. I mean, it's not perfect. This car needs to be, needs a good polish. And I need to test out that chemical guys for the winter on here for the industrial environment. What do you guys think? All right. We'll take a look at it. Paint kind of, it's mills. Gave it a nice uh, smooth finish. Works good. I still gotta do the tires a little bit. I just wanted to give a quick cleaning. I've been working a lot, and I just wanted to clean it up real quick a little bit. And the hood came out nice. You can see the the clouds above. Not bad. But uh, yeah, that's it, guys. So, so tell me what you guys think of this product right here. It's not bad. It's not bad. Okay, sorry about that guys, I almost dropped my camera. Um, so basically, that's what it looks like. It looks pretty good, let me know what you think. I really like testing out uh, drying aids, spray wax and stuff like that. Um, I just enjoy doing it and testing them out. Um, I, I like do that, doing that better than actually trying out a wax or something like that or a sealant. Um, I think these products, using these once a month or every time you wash, is perfect for getting a little bit of layer of protection on your vehicle real quick. And basically the protection on this is not, you know, gone. So we're kind of getting a, a look what it does to the vehicle without any. And I think it does pretty good. I did the windows right here. I'm not looking to get any lawn protection on it. Like I said, maybe a couple weeks, you know, maybe a month. We'll, who knows? Uh, right now it's September. I got to get ready to start getting these vehicles ready for the winter. Going to be busy. Um, I got to do some stuff on a Corvette too for a car show coming up at the end of the month. And looks pretty decent. Okay, we got some bonus footage. I put this on, let's see, it's Wednesday, three days ago. It's rain today. Check it out. Look at the beating from this stuff. That's pretty good. I mean, I don't expect it to last but a couple weeks, but look at the beating from the rain that's pretty dang good guys from this Hawaiian shine from Jack's wax it's nice to uh, make this little bit of footage before I edit a video so I can show you guys real quick this will probably last maybe a month it beat up nice and then when I was driving on the freeway too, the, the water, man, was just flying right off when I was on the freeway. 
it was pretty cool still has a nice shine to it I noticed too it's uh, at work because sometimes it gets real dusty in this and that the last couple days it's been keeping the dust off of it pretty well so it's not attracting any dust so that's a that's a good plus so all right so i figured i'd throw this in here as it's raining but uh continue to watch the video for the ending so i'm gonna throw this footage real quick and kind of after i apply it so you guys will make sure you watch it because a lot of you guys i know are not watching the whole video to the end and you won't be able to see what this product can you know do on beating on rainwater not no hose water rainwater we've got a storm coming look at that check it out yeah all right keep watching all right guys sorry about the ending and just having some issues with this camera and that and uh trying to get the videos done and that um so yeah thanks for watching this uh guys i really appreciate it appreciate you guys uh always watching our videos and commenting without you guys uh we wouldn't have a channel so thank you guys have a great day now get out there and watch those rides